New at six rough road conditions heading into Pineville from South Carolina have frustrated drivers for years, but now York County says it's just about ready to make some major improvements. WCNC Charlotte's Kaylin Hagwood spoke to the engineering team behind the fix and the people in the area who say they are ready for a smoother ride. People who live and work in this area tell me Highway 51 is a nightmare and almost impassable after work hours. After more than 10 years of working, the county says a fix is coming soon. Rocky Old Pineville Road sits right on the North and South Carolina line. On the North Carolina side, engineers call it a five lane road. But in South Carolina, people who live here say it's a two lane nightmare. I mean, for me and some of my neighbors here, it's, you know, less than a quarter of a mile and it takes 20 minutes to get that far. So it's absolutely extremely frustrating. Alana Stevens is the manager at State Line Beverage on the South Carolina side. She says your county gained ownership of part of their land years ago to widen the road. So many potholes and everything else that they're afraid that they're going to take out their tires. And I mean, we've had more than enough people who have complained to us and we don't even own it. Patrick Hamilton, the assistant York County engineer, says the road repair and widening project has been more than 10 years in the making, with money from the penny sales tax already approved. He says the size of the project and amount of land they had to acquire extended the timeline. There's about 100 parcels or pieces of property that we had to acquire property from. Also a challenge, preparing utility providers. But he says they're now nearing construction, with the project set to be up for bid in June. Once completed, they'll widen part of Highway 51 and nearby Highway 21 into five lanes. I know Highway 51 is in terrible shape. I get emails about it weekly. However, it does take time in order to get all of it built. People who live in the area just hopeful change comes soon. Who knows if it's going to be 10 more years, but um, if they do do that, it'll make it a heck of a lot better. Well, the county says those repairs could begin as early as this fall. Reporting here in Fort Mill, Kaylin Hagwood, WCNC Charlotte.